Hi everyone, this is Ty Williams. How are everyone doing today? And here's the question you see right here. 6ix9ine is challenging Yin Mei Ya. If you don't know who Yin Mei Ya is, look at the picture right now. You can read her. And also, I'll put the link down below in his video, Yaya. When I watch that music video, the first thing that come to mind in 6 9 video is that he is definitely is connected to Santa Maria. He is letting us know that Latino people are deep with the Santa Maria right now. Like all this stuff going on, the world we're living in, we are in a spiritual battle with people who so into Santa Maria, into Wicca, into Voodoo. People are, people are not religious no more because the religion and church is so corrupt and now people is trying to find a way to connect with God and I feel like 6 9 is trying to connect with Yemaya and I think the reason why he used Yemaya in his video is that he's having issues with his baby mama I see that through him when he and her break up or separated he was upset deeply because guys when they in love with a girl like Maddie like fall in love with the girl and the, and something happened they broke up the guy always find a girl that looks like his ex-girlfriend and if you look at the video the dancer in the beginning the model in the beginning looked like his ex-baby mama and I got the link down below and she looked just like his baby mama and I feel like he is doing some Santa Maria stuff lately too that's why I have to do this video if you notice certain clips about him pouring milk on himself and on the girls in Santa Maria culture milk is a form of cleansiness to remove all evil bad luck misfortune and Santa Maria like priests or priestesses use goat milk and milk um, in general to cleanse their clients and that's why he was saying something um, in Spanish in water and Yemaya represent water too she represent the queen of the sea she represent um, the mother of all Orishas as well and if you study Yemaya if you look up her offering like her offering is coconut milk um, goat milk um, regular milk water watermelons fish to Yemaya and some people use these offering and put it in the water to to want something from her and I believe that sis nine is 
Yaya, to be honest with you. If you look at um, my sister, um, what is Yaya means, you will understand everything. So it's a deep connection. And like he, like he got Yaya on, on his forehead, if you see the beginning of the video. So Yaya could be himself. And also, he want women to be yayas, be mamas, be baby mamas, or um, bring fem feminine energy into the world. And Yimaya represent feminine energy. And I feel he want everyone to get into Yemaya and to worship her. And nothing wrong to worship Yemaya because I feel like I tell you like I think last month or May, either one. Yemaya is a healer and a nurturer and also protector of women and children. So I feel like his message in this video is related to women's, Latino women's, and their children. And the thing that going on right now around the world, there are more missing children than missing woman like if you notice that children is more in danger than women and men too but because i remember back when i was growing up women's always been in danger you know but now it's like People is like kidnapping children, raping children, and murdering them. Look at the news. And I feel like when he did something like that, I feel like he bringing something very corrupt. Because if you notice his uh, wall, and uh, he was dancing around with this model on the tub and the wall is blue and pink and blue and pink represent bisexuality and there's lots of symbols about bisexuality so i feel like he's trying to push the bisexuality agenda with yemaya i know it sounds crazy to you when i talk about this think about it do your research is something is very off about that music video and there are more guys watching this music video and looking at nothing but latino women with big bucks with big booties shaking it and if you notice, they are worship. They are worship. They are worshiping Yemaya. I don't know why I couldn't talk today, but anyway, this is Ty Williams. Good day and goodbye.